What's up guys? Cyrax has another new video. This time it's getting old. So what the fuck is he talking about? Let's check it out. What's up y'all? So I am going to say this right off right to Fruity Beauty who actually ended up standing up for me yesterday. I just want to say thank you. I truly appreciate what you did. Like, I can't thank you enough. Like, aside from the misconception that I'm autistic when I'm actually not, which I understand where you get that misconception, I do, so it's all good. Like, I'm not ragging on you. I totally understand where you're coming from with that. Wow, so you just gotta say a few nice things about Cyrax and he'll let you call him autistic and not get mad. It's a, it's a nice little fact to know. I get that actually quite a bit. It's actually very common that, you know, I get mistaken for something that may be autistic. I totally get that. So there's no hatred at all. I'm not mad. I totally get it. But as for the rest of y'all that have attacked her about this shit, man, she's right, dude. I mean, y'all going after so many fucking people. So many people you guys have gone after for what? For what reason? To make money? To get laughs? And every single person in your target audience is some form of special needs. Which I'm not necessarily special needs, but I look it. Which is why you guys and started to attack me. No, people attack you because you're a little monster. Because you tried to get a fucking 14 year old to send you nudes. It's not because of your looks, that's just a convenient thing to make fun of you for. And it's fucking ridiculous. It's disgusting and it's wrong. I mean, first you guys start out with Christian, then you guys move on to Suplex City Vlogs. Then you guys move on to Tony, and then you move on to Heather Colonna. And then you go back to me. Somewhere in all that mix. And it's not right. Like, I understand, like, and don't get me wrong, Foodie, I understand where you're coming from saying that, you know, I need to try to ignore these people, and you're right. And I do try. But as you said, it's very hard to do so when they keep coming to your house and doing all this stuff. It makes it very hard. Very hard to ignore. And what makes it even harder when I'm online and doing stuff is these people taking my stuff and stealing it and doing this and doing that. It does make it hard. And I am working, you know, on a way to deal with this stuff legally through my family and friends and stuff like that. I am working on a way to deal with this legally. But for all y'all trolls out there, man, that are doing this, you guys need to find something else to do. Seriously. Find something else to do other than to screw with people. I mean, what you guys do is bullshit. It's wrong and it's not okay. You have said that exactly 13,782 times, and it has worked exactly zero times. What you guys do is complete garbage. What you guys do is total and utter garbage. I mean... Don't you have kids to take care of? Don't you guys have jobs to do? I mean, y'all sit there and say you work, but I can tell you for a fact that half y'all don't. Yeah, like some people can have jobs better than, you know, Walmart or McDonald's, like the fucking places you think you have to work. Some people can have a computer in front of them all day and they get to watch you while working. It's amazing. And the reason why I know that half y'all don't work 
is because of the fact that how y'all motherfuckers sit online all day waiting for me to post something or say or do something. I'm at my work computer right now waiting for you to post so I can do this. It's like to tell y'all right now, half y'all motherfuckers don't work. Hell, I'm pretty sure about 95 to 99% of y'all don't fucking work. Like, dude, I'm over here working on music. I'm over here working on game development shit. I'm over here actually doing shit. Trying to make a real ass fucking living so I can support my family. You know, if you think that's work, what the hell do you think everybody's doing that's not work? I mean, do you think everybody's just staring at a wall all fucking day? And as I said in my last video, the only reason why I'm not able to make a living off my shit is because y'all want to sit there and run it into the ground every damn time. Because y'all want to believe this bullshit that I'm a supposed pedophile. Y'all want to believe that bullshit, so y'all sit there and you automatically assume, oh, we can fuck with him all we want. He's this, he's that. No, the fuck I'm not. You absolutely are. There's undeniable proof of Kate fucking getting you to, to say you want a 14-year-old to send you nudes. And then when you were talking about it, you admitted to doing it to two other children before that. It's from your own mouth and you're trying to walk it back. Alright, y'all seriously need to get the fuck over that shit, it's old news. Like, y'all are just trying to put a fucking label on me so you can target me. Y'all are trying to justify that whole ass setup. You guys are using that bullshit ass setup to fuck with people like myself, and it's wrong. It ain't cool, and it ain't right, and it needs to fucking stop. Like, I'm over here every day, working on music, working on songs, working on ideas for songs, working on instrumentals for songs. Hell, I've got two and a half freaking notebooks full of fucking songs written out, ready to go. On top of what I've already got recorded from the past two to three months of not doing shit really. But yet, I'm not able to release it because people like William and freaking idiotic glory hole over there, every time I post my music, wants to sit there and take all my music and get the copyrights for it just so that he can sit there and take my shit and keep me from making money, and that's bullshit. Why don't you copyright it then? Why don't you act like the professional artist you are and protect your music like everyone in the world who makes music does? That's fucking wrong. That's fucking stupid. Like I said in my last video, I know exactly what y'all are trying to do. Y'all are trying to turn me into the next Chris, and the next fucking Chris Chan. I know what y'all are trying to do and it's not going to work. Y'all want to try to make me out to be the next Chris Chan and it's fucking stupid. It's distasteful. It's unbecoming. It's nasty. It's wrong. It's stupid. Yeah, I know I've reacted poorly to a lot of the shit that's gone on. But like Foodie Beauty said, what do you guys expect when you sit there and you push someone over and over and over and over and over again until they snap? Like, what do you expect? People expect exactly what you do. You rage out, and you deliver it over and over, and you make these whining videos like you're doing right now. It's what people expect, and you give it to them every time. I mean, you sit there, you harass and attack me online, you steal my artwork, you steal my music, and get all that shit copyrighted so I don't make money. You guys make me lose my job at Twitch. 
as an actual paid streamer doing very well not well at all like a hundred dollars is nothing and you're like oh compound that by 12 months well that's twelve hundred dollars and it's still fucking nothing to live off of you make me lose my job and all my sponsors that i had you guys caused my biological father to lose his job you caused my friend brendan to lose his job and then y'all sit there and attack anybody that stands up for me and fucking defends me. And it ain't right. It's fucking stupid. And y'all sit there and wonder why I get mad? I mean, you guys show up to my house. You guys steal shit from my house. You guys assault me. You guys tried to kill me by shooting at me through my fucking window. And you expect me not to get mad or pissed off? You expect me not to get mad or angry or say something? Dude, y'all are delusional as fuck. That's right. The man who thinks a sniper shot an ice bullet through his window in a targeted atta assassination attempt thinks you're delusional. I mean, anybody with a half a brain would react the exact same fucking way that I have this whole time. The exact same way. I mean, you guys sit there and you attack me and you expect me not to fucking fire back. I mean, it's fucking bullshit. Yeah, you guys get to sit there and attack me and harass me. You guys don't get arrested. But the one time I fucking fire back, I get arrested. I call fucking bullshit on that. Because you guys antagonize this shit. You trolls fucking start this shit. I don't start nothing. You guys fucking start it. I try to run away from it, you guys follow. I get off the internet, you guys try to have me killed. Is this video running away from it? Is this video getting off the internet? Is this video doing anything to help your situation? Or is it just egging on more people to harass you? Because it shows that you fucking go off. I try to do my own music start my own clothing line, you know, do my own shit that I've actually proven I can make money at. You guys rip it away from me. When does it fucking stop, dude? When does the garbage stop and when do you guys move the fuck on and do something else with your lives? Never. This is the rest of your life, Cyrax because you can't stop making videos and harassing people and getting angry. This is the rest of your fucking life. Well, like I said, I understand that I've reacted poorly to a lot of shit. But you have to think, you motherfucking trolls are the ones that started this shit. You guys antagonize this shit. You guys continue the garbage. How I react is based on how you treat me. You treat me like a kind human being and you treat me like a person, I'm going to show you decency and respect. You start fucking with me and attacking me and my family and my friends and doing what you guys are going to do, I'm going to react accordingly. How you treat me is how I react. I react to how you treat me, the same as any other person. Like I said, that dude had no business being here. He came here to fuck with my family. He had no business being here. Just like Marty, you didn't have any business being here. You came here for the same reason that dude did, to fuck with me, to antagonize me. 
You know, I'm kind of fucking sick of hearing you tell people that you had no business being there. It's a public fucking sidewalk. You're not the king of the sidewalk. You don't get to say who comes to Akron and who's not allowed to come to Akron and who's allowed to do what when they're in Akron. You're a fucking idiot. You don't get to do that. Oh, for the record, Marty, you can't sit there and deny that you came off that fucking porch charging at me at first because you know you did. You came at me charging off that fucking porch, motherfucker. You came charging at me and I reacted accordingly. I came over there to talk to you and you sat there and assaulted me. Oh, yeah? Is that how you fucking remember it? Because I think we have fucking video of it. Oh. You're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit pillow biter just like every other fucking troll out there. All y'all motherfuckers are gay for each other. We all know it. Really? You're just gonna call people gay now? We're just gay because we troll you. Y'all motherfuckers need to grow the fuck up and find a new fucking hobby. And leave people the fuck alone. Like seriously. Stop doing the dumb shit you guys do to people and maybe people wouldn't fucking react the way they do. Maybe if you dumb motherfuckers stop doing what you guys are doing. You'd actually see that people like myself can actually be chill. But you guys don't want to see that. You want to see rage filled garbage. And it's nasty. That kind of content goes nowhere fast. That kind of content is garbage. It's trash. The kind of content that I do with vocal covers. With creating music. With doing gameplay videos. Promoting my own shit, that gets somewhere. Don't believe me? Check my stats, motherfucker. Go ahead, check my stats. I've proven that I've been successful with that shit. Multiple times over. But y'all don't want to see that. Y'all only want to see rage-filled garbage and it's not right. Which is why I'm telling y'all right now, y'all need to grow the fuck up. And actually go off and do something else. And I agree with Foodie, with Foodie Beauty when she said that motherfuckers like you guys that bully people. You guys have no place on the internet. You guys don't belong on the internet. Because what you guys do is wrong. And it needs to stop. So like I said, I can promise you all this. I'm going to fight this shit no matter what. And to Foodie Beauty, again, I want to say thank you for what you did. I truly, truly appreciate what you did. I know my family appreciates it. 100%. But as for you fucking trolls, man, I'm going to say this. Fuck off. Get off the goddamn internet. And get a real job and stop being lazy. Get a real job or a fucking hobby and leave people alone. Yep, yep. The man wants us to grow up after he just called us all gay. So, yeah, awesome. Good, good, good speech, Cyrax. I think it's just going to get everybody to stop immediately. Like it does every fucking time you make one of these. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Have a good day.